These days we expect men to cook the bacon too and clean up and do the dishes afterwards, of course. So is this just equality or are we asking too much of our men? I think so. I'm, I'm a bit old-fashioned in that sense. Um, the hunter-gatherer, you know, the macho man looking after the family. Um, I, you know, I do agree with equal rights and if women want to go and work, that's fabulous. And I think, if anything, when men come home, I think it's more of a case of being more of a part of the family, um, being with the children, spending more time with the children, um, being a, a strong role model. But I think it's going as far as cooking, and putting the apron on, and I, I think that kind of... Not belittles men, but it takes the masculinity, and, and I Does would it? miss that. I, I think there's something that. very sexy about a man. Which depends a, what they're wearing, penny. I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> Just a penny. Just a penny, yeah. Just a penny. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, but but they, what they're saying, Penny, is exactly what you're saying, that, you know, the, being the breadwinner is, like, number eight on this list of mm -hmm. importance now, according to women, and saying it's much more important for fathers to be a role model for their children, to play with the kids, to be yeah. involved. And half of this, I go... Well, it's not rocket science, men. You know, you're in a partnership, you've got children, your wife probably goes to work. Like, do, just share, get on with it. Absolutely. You don't need to and, be told. And, Penny, I'm sorry I disagree with you on this That's one fine. because I think... Bring it on. You know, I work, I hunter and I gather and I, <laughs> and I do all of those things that men do. Mm. Um, but, you know, why is it that I have to do all of the... You know, mm. bring, the, bring the bacon home. Well, I can't actually bring the bacon home because my family are Muslim. But, anyway, <laughs> um, so bring home the vegetarian yeah. sausage. How come I have to do that and all the housework and everything mm. else? Um, you know, and, but actually, to be fair, my husband is amazing. He does the cooking, he does the cleaning. Ooh, ooh. Um, and, actually, sorry, he does the cooking, he does the ironing. I've never seen him clean the toilet or the bathroom. That's my my job but um, but but you know too right I want my children to see mum and dad do things at home together and that's what you're supposed to do and I've actually told my seven-year-old if you don't want to be nagged for the rest of your life get involved with house, mm. house household duties yeah, because but the it's thing important. is we will still find a way to nag because it's like <laughs> yeah you know women come home and go well he emptied the dishwasher but he didn't do it properly <laughs> yeah yeah we don't just do that don't i don't do that, do that but i've got so many friends that do well you know we did put the laundry away but it was all in the wrong place yeah, and i'm yeah, like yeah. well give them a break but then you've only got yourselves to blame if you do that i think women we are our own worst enemy sometimes because you do exactly that like you never help around the house then they do something you go oh let me do that you haven't We're done different, it properly we're different aren't we you have to accept <laughs> Differences. I mean, obviously, this, I think there's got to be an equal balance. If you're both working just as hard as each other, both coming in at the same time, they need to share those roles. But men are men, men from mm. Mars, women from Venus, mm. um, testosterone, mm. oestrogen. I mean, we're different creatures, yeah. so I think you, you've got to let men do it their way. You know? That means we get chocolate for breakfast in yeah, my house. Yeah, chocolate for breakfast. <laughs> 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 Jack is quite happy with that, yeah. funnily. <laughs>